it's Melissa. Happy Thursday. It's our fourth day of our half birthday celebration and we've got lots of stuff um, going on. It's been a great week. If you have missed any of the three previous bundles, um, don't let this one get away. It is a script font bundle. It's got 21 fonts um, and it's $25.99 which makes each of the fonts about just over a dollar each. All commercial use. Now, Here's the question that we get a lot. Um, my fonts are missing. I downloaded them, I installed them, I opened up my program, um, and they are not in my font list. So if you're using Silhouette Studio, or you're using um, Word even, or you're using Adobe, or whatever it is that you're using, if you're looking for fonts and they are not there, there is probably one big reason why. They are not missing, they are hiding, okay? So I'm gonna show you how to find them um, and why they end up hiding um, in just a second. But I'm gonna turn you around and we're gonna look at the script font bundle and I'm gonna show you um, the name of the font and then what happens when you pull it into your program sometimes. All right, so beautiful script font bundle. As I said, it is back today only um, just for our half birthday celebration. Uh, this was a hugely popular bundle, 90% off, only going to be around until midnight tonight. So make sure you grab it. Okay, so here are some of the fonts that are included. Let me turn the flash off. Um, and you can see there's, um, they're all script fonts, obviously. Okay, so um, I love them. Um, but what happens, let's say you have mermaid tails. This doesn't happen for all of them, but what sometimes happens is, happens is you download them and then when you restart your program they are not there or they appear not to be there so I'm going to show you where they actually are okay all right so here is I have mine they were downloaded um, installed on my computer and then first thing you need to do is restart your program that that is um, something that you need to do whether you're using Silhouette Studio whether you're using PowerPoint whatever it is that you're using you will likely need to restart your computer okay all right so here I have Lola Bell that was part of that's part of the script font bundle and you can see it's here but let's say I want to find mermaid tail and I go down here and these are in alphabetical order and it's not there I've got Mary and then I've got Merry Christmas and then I've got some Mickey thing and there is no mermaid tail to be found, okay? So it should be in here. Well, what happens is the designer has put their initials in front of it. And so this designer um, is Keetaly, and she has put her initials KL, or her shop initials, in front of all of her fonts. And the reason that she does that, so you can see here is mermaid tails. So even though it's called, the font itself is called mermaid tails, the file, the font file, is named KL Mermaid Tales, okay? And so you can see all of these fonts, KL Crazy, I've got I've got numerous, I love her fonts, uh, Blackbird, Blast, KL Crazy, these are all Keetaly files, or fonts, and they're all grouped together in my font list. Now why I love that some designers do this is because now I know every font that I have of, of hers, um, came with a commercial license. And so I know if I need um, a commercial use font, including Mermaid Tails, because every font on um, So Fonsi comes with a commercial use, all of these are actually from So Fonsi, I'll know that all of these are safe for commercial use, okay? So if you're ever looking for a font and you can't find it, that may be why. Um, Rivka's Renditions is another one who does the same thing. She puts RR in front of most of her fonts. So you can see up here, this one's Beautiful Dreamer, which we have on Sofonsi, RR um, in front of it, okay? So there's quite a few designers who do that. Another one that I know of that does that is Design Shark, um, and she'll have, obviously, the DS in front of her names. Um, and again, that is so, here's one right here, DS, why not? That is so that you can... Um, identify them and they are all grouped together when they're in the t um, in the list, okay? All right, guys, so I want you to head over, grab this script font bundle while it's available. It will expire tonight. Please, if you email me at 12.09, um, I can't bring it back, okay? So it's only good, I'm giving you a fair warning, there's even a countdown clock on there so you know um, when to get it, all right? All right, guys, have a great day. I'll see you tomorrow for our very last 
um, our last bundle that we're going to re-release and bring out of retirement. It's got a little edge to it, so I think you guys will like it. All right, guys, have a good day.